Good day friends, Boda Bob here with Boda Tip number three. What I want to talk today about is um, why my receiver is painted red, orange. Don't matter what color you paint it, just don't paint it black like the Stinger is. So the reason I got that painted orange is because once you push it in so far, you really don't know how far you got it in. And you got to get down there and look for the hole. So what I do, push that back in until it's even, and then you know where you're at, and it's real easy to um, put your uh, pin in. Some people, they might not like that because, you know, they, they don't want it painted. You can paint the whole thing, just don't paint the, the back part, the part that's inside the uh, receiver. And there you go. Um, simple, fast, easy, you know, and if the paint ever scrapes off, just shoot another. What you do, put your pin in there, and then shoot the paint around it. And then when you uh, let it dry, when you pull it out, you'll, ha you'll know where to stop um, sliding it in. I've done, it really comes in handy. Once again, I got the swivel hitch pin. As you can see here, I got it painted there. Oh, hold on. And I have it painted back here at this place. And so I just slide it in there like that. Grab my hitch pin. Oh. There you go. You know roughly where it's at. Uh, so there you go. That's uh, one of my tips that I've discovered. Slide it in, and there you go. And remember to pin your pin or flip the retainer so you don't lose your hitch pin. There you have it, Boda tip number three. Uh, spray paint your trailer hitches so you know where you're at. So if you got any questions, drop them down below. There you have it, folks. Boda tip number three. Paint your hitches so that you know where your um, holes, that your holes are lining up between the hitch and the receiver. And until next time, enjoy the journey. Cheers. Stop record.